how to reset and to reconfigure a little Wi-Fi range extender. This is uh, called a Belkin F9K1015. The instructions that I found aren't that good, so I'm going to show you how to do it. You'll want to reset it. There's a button, a little dot under there that you can push a pin into. Hold it in for 40 seconds and then let go. And that takes a long time and you'll know it's done because it, the light changes to a solid blue color. I'm going to do that right now. Okay, so I had to hold that button in for 45 seconds until it turned blue. Now, any moment we should see a new Wi-Fi SSID called Belkin.setup. Here it is, Belkin.setup. Let's open that and connect. Okay. Let's open up a browser. And the uh, most of the instructions say you should go to something called Belkin.range. If, if that doesn't work for you, what you can do is go to look at the properties here in the setup. And if you scroll down, you see the DNS server address, 192.168.206.1. And you can also type that address in. So I'll show you that. 192.168.206.1. And that takes me straight to the setting up page. That's if the address HTTP Belkin dot range doesn't work for you because it doesn't always work from experience and uh, also I'm going to take note of this MAC address and that's how I'm going to verify that I'm connecting via the the new Belkin ex range extender anyway start searching for SSID Now I want to connect to my Wi-Fi, which is that one there. Okay, network password. confirm it's now configured close radio now back down to my Wi-Fi settings and this this should disappear after a while it uh, might take 30 seconds or something um, but what I'll need to do is connect to my normal Wi-Fi which hasn't shown up just yet but there it is there this one's still showing but that will disappear let's connect connect automatically well it's connected already it does that sometimes now I just want to verify that I'm connecting via the little Belkin extender so I'm just going to check the MAC address on the properties and uh, that's the MAC address of the extender and that's the name of my Wi-Fi my real Wi-Fi so that's working thanks for watching remember to comment like and subscribe and share always share